What is up, humans? We have another Chad Muska dropping, like, right now, like, as soon as we can get it in the store. Uh, these just came in. We're going to try to have a little look at these for you. Um, but here's the box. You got tan and green. Tan and green. That's what we're calling these things. This is a size 9. We have sizes 9 through 12, I believe. They're 150 bucks. You can get them on bluetilesc.com. Um, and they fit pretty true to size. I just tried the 11 and a half on. <clears throat> Sometimes the, um, the different models between the S models kind of fit either snug or big. I think the Tom Pennies were huge. Um, I think the Muska, this Muska specifically, just tried it on. I think it fits pretty true to size. And uh, yeah, I like this one. Let's pop it open right here. What is up? Here is your Chad Muska in tan and green. This thing dates back to 1997 or 98 time frame, and uh, it's got all the bulk to remind you of that. So there you go. You got 3M right here with your S logo, and then of course you got this little uh, this little pull thing, pull tab to kind of help pull your shoe on, but also. This thing kind of helps your jeans from getting under your heel when you're wearing those baggy Jinkos, you know? Are you guys wearing Jinkos yet? I know one of my homies is. <laughs> anyway, so there you go. We got this, this Chad Muska, tan and green. It's got this mesh panel on the heel cup, but also right here for breathability. But the mesh also has this like TPU mesh layer over it which gives that a little bit of more a little bit more durability as well so um, as far as ollie protection this is pretty crazy i always loved that they did this little accent right there that popped through the leather and you got your um tpu or rubber ollie spot right there rubber right here also and a rubber toe box or a rubber toe bumper so you don't blow through these from ollie's Dude, these things are tanks. You guys all know it. Um, you got a, a PU midsole in there, give you extra cushion, and these things obviously feel like pillows. There's a lot of padding in there, and they definitely fit really, really good. Really true to size and super comfy. You've also got these molded TPU uh, lace holes right there that protect your laces from popping when you're skating. S branding right here and also on the tongue. Obviously you got S and Muska there. And you got this little um, this little lace lock right here to keep your laces nice and tight. I used to take these off and put them on my jeans, my shoelace that was holding my jeans up. So um, yeah, that was the 90s. Of course, you have your signature puffy tongue and your, um, your, your stash pocket in there so you can put your, uh, your quarter for your payphone in your, in your uh, tongue right there. That's exactly what that's for. There you go. You have these Lycra tongue centering straps in there as well to keep that giant pillow on top of your foot centered. And then here is your Muska insole. So you just got this kind of ortholite vibe perforated and your muska branding on the on the sock liner so that's pretty cool pretty iconic <clears throat> these do come these do come with this additional green lace as well um, i kind of like the boot lace looking vibe better so that's probably what i would rock in those but you have that option to swap them out if you want to so dudes i think this is the Four. This is at least the fourth color of these we've gotten in, and they're doing really well. So if you want to scoop yourself a pair, you can get them from BlueTileSC.com. If they're not up there right now when you look, they will be there soon. Um, we're just now getting these in, and I'm busting the box out. I was not planning on making this video this week. So there you go, guys. What do you think of the, the rebirth of the Muska back in the line for several months now? So pretty cool. I don't know. Epic. Um, here's something that I like that I get in trouble for every time I talk about this, but I love this little label right here that denotes that these shoes are vegan and it talks about how there's no animal byproducts used in making this here shoe. So pretty epic. I like that. I know a lot of people like that. Nobody died 
for your cool kicks. So that's pretty sick. Um, guys, I think that's it. BlueTileSC.com, S. Chad Muska, Reborn. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next one. I got so much going on. If you're in the Columbia, South Carolina area or you feel like driving a couple hours or whatever, there's a St. Patrick's Day Festival this Saturday, March 16th in Five Points. And uh, we're going to have a ramp there. The border's helping us out with that. They're going to judge it. They're going to build it. The border ramp is coming up from Florida, and it's going to live in Columbia just for a couple days. So hopefully we'll see you there. Until then, all the best. Love Blue Tile, as, as always. Dude, we're still growing. We're still trying to get all this stuff put away and, and taken care of. So that's why I know on foot. I'm, no, I'm not even going to say that. That's it.